Okay, we are back with the swindle. This is the second one that I've done. Uh, last stream, we did got a couple upgrades. Uh, died a few times. We're gonna try to do better today. Um, if you missed the last one, the swindle is a stealth game. 2D stealth, but it's also procedural in the how the levels are laid out. Um, and uh, the structure of the game is you are a group of uh, thieves, and your task is to whoa, is to steal a powerful uh, security device that is going to go into operation uh, in 100 days. So you have 100 lives, essentially, to uh, try to get to the end and steal it. And if you fail, if you get to the day zero and you haven't done it, uh, all your upgrades, all the money you made, basically all progress you've made uh, resets. And so you try again. The trick is, is the skill that you uh, gain as you, as you play, uh, you, might, you might start out uh, the very first time only getting to the warehouse district in like 30 lives. Whereas this time I made it in three. Uh, uh, and making different choices with your upgrades, you can find out what works for you, what doesn't work for you. Um, and, uh, yeah, so it's pretty good. Um, let's see. 84 days left. Symphony Alcock. Okay. <sighs> like I can suck it. There's no nothing in there for me, so I won't be going in there. Really isn't any there anything in there for me either. I don't have bombs yet, so I'm not gonna be getting to that computer. That will be the next thing I purchase is the ability to drop bombs. Plant bombs. Oh, I can't do anything. Cause I can't hack any doors either. Which is a real problem. Um in fact, the number of times now that I have run into this problem makes me a little concerned about whether or not I should even be trying to play these levels. I didn't really get much out of that, and I died anyway, so there's the end of that one. Uh, return to the airship, and maybe try going to the slums. That might actually work out better as smaller payouts, but at least I know I have access to the whole level and can actually get a decent amount of cash coming out of here.
my way out. Oh. Not the most nimble jumper, this one. Oh boy. Okay. Let's try again. It's not good. Not a good look on that one. Yeah, by the way, don't mess up on hacking a mine. That will, uh, understandably kill you. Man, I am getting fucking sloppy. Well, I'm gonna try to get as much out of this as I can. If I can find a computer to hack, I will do so. And I will do it quickly. And I will get out before it's too late. Okay. Okay, here I go. Hoping that going back to the warehouse district will actually... They won't give me a level that I can't get into. They were doing that too often. These guys uh, are just designed to stop you from jumping anywhere near them. And sometimes they put them in a real devious place. Other times, not so much. Look, look at this. There's two computers side by side. No problem. Alright. Good haul. Look at that. 6,044 pounds. If I can get up here, I will continue. Oh. Yep. Here we go. Continue the swindle. Let's keep this thing rolling. Oh my god, look at that. More money. And nothing in my way. This is a nice one. This is one real nice one, actually. The only thing I'm going to be careful of is that I don't put myself in a scenario where I can't get back out. See, if you can't get back out, you gotta sacrifice yourself. You know what? I think I've got everything I can get out of this one without having any bombs. Yeah. Thank you, Herman Bros Warehousing. You were very lucrative for me. Now we'll buy some cool upgrades. And we'll, you'll be able to see how some things can change and how the game adapts to you buying upgrades. Okay. Let's check it out. Another heist. Turn to the airship. Okay. Here we go. Double jump I've already got. I want the ability to hack skill. We need that to open a door. 
So that is a definite purchase. Uh, and bombs. Let's get some of those. We can't. Can't yet. That's a shame. That's a real shame. But I might be able to increase my melee power or something along along those lines. Got to be something I can do for two thousand. Nothing. That's about it, I guess. So, we'll take her back out. Now, I want to keep this stream to about half an hour. So, we'll see how much progress we can make in that period of time. We're 11 minutes, 49 seconds in. We'll see what we can do in that period of time. I'm trying to keep things to a schedule. I've got a few things to do still today. And, uh, see how that goes. Oosh! Wasn't sure I had him, I thought he might have gotten me. Kind of cool. If you stand close to uh, pieces of machinery, you'll actually hear the different the sound change dynamically. It's a nice little touch for a little indie game. Again. Uh, I mentioned this on the last stream, but I actually uh, was convinced to buy this game just from a conversation on Idle Thumbs podcast. And I suggest, if you like podcasts and you like video games, uh, that is a good one. It's maybe the best one. Uh, I really think they do some cool stuff. And, uh, yeah, so you should give them a listen. Good recommendations. I think last year they made me buy 80 days on iOS with their suggestions. Another cool game. I'm gonna get caught here. But it does not matter because I got the money. And I'm getting out of here. Alright, I'm gonna go buy another upgrade. The bombs. Want the bombs. Alright, we got bombs. We can blow shit up. Next step is to get a bunch of money and unlock the next area so that we can get a lot of money towards buying the next upgrade sets of upgrades. And maybe improving the hack aptitude too, that could that could help. I wonder 
Maybe I can really just... Ah, I thought I was going to destroy the camera, but I didn't. No such luck. And there's another computer right there. This is a nice, nice level. Laid out for my convenience, it would seem. I don't dare jump anywhere near that guy. <laughs> Send him through the window. See what's out this way. Whoa, what the fuck happened there? What? That was weird. I did hit the wrong thing. Hmm. Alright. Maybe it was the angle. I was standing at a weird angle on those stairs. Maybe the controls weird. I don't know. I've never had a bomb explode on me like that for nothing. Out of nowhere. I might have let go of the hack button. Hmm. Well, we're 18 minutes. Let's see if I, if I can at least get to the next area, show you guys that. Oh my god! That time was my fault. I pressed the wrong thing. Alright, 77 days remain. It's not very good. If I'm if I'm correct, that would mean I've died ten times already on this stream. Fuck. I'm on a weird angle again. Ah, oh, I thought I might survive that. Nope. I'm trying to be cheeky. Now I gotta wait for this guy to come all the way out before I can kill him. I haven't actually shown you guys what a bomb does yet, but it's coming. I feel it. Oh no, I thought, ugh, bad timing on that one. This is a death fest. I should retitle this episode the not so sneaky one. Oh no. That was close. Almost blown up by my friendly mine. 
I don't know why I did that. Oh god! This is a disaster. Holy crap. Okay. Let's focus. I'm gonna do a let's focus on this one. It's funny, because they don't have anything in common, really, other than them being stealth games. But this makes me want to play Thief so much. And given that the only Thief I have available to play right now is the not-so-great 2014 Thief, uh, I don't know if I'm going to do that. But I might. Maybe that's something I can do. Play that with an interesting way, in an interesting way. Maybe ghost it. Show you guys my skills. Because I don't mean to brag, but decent at stealth games. It's why, it's why it's, I think th that's kind of just why I like them that much. Is just, just those are the type of games I'm good at. So those are the ones that I'm drawn to. And that's why I like them so much. But, I don't know, on the focus, on the topic of Thief. Thief the Dark Project might be my favorite game that's ever been made. Games like Dishonored are right up there. But, man. You're not touching Thief. It's so good. Oh, come on. Alright. You know what? To cut some time down, I'm going to bomb these areas here. Just so you can see. So you plant your bomb. You get the shit out of dodge. I'll set another one here. You can set them on a wall too. Like if you're slide down a wall, well, they'll, they'll go on a wall. I just blew up my money. Oh, I didn't blow up my money. That's cool. I can use that as a shortcut if I blow up this wall. Will it work? Can I get out of here? Super quickly. Uh, I don't know. Look at that. It's a mess down there. I don't think I can go down that, with it, that way without dying. Probably go up this way though. Up and out. Perfect. I like it. I like it a lot. Alright, so let's return to the airship real quick. See if I can get access to the next area. Ooh, 25,000. I don't think we're going to have time. So I will instead buy an upgrade to show you guys on the next time. 
by the Steam Purge. It's basically a cloak or an escape device. If you get spotted, you can activate that and get away. Um, basically surrounds you with steam. Uh, we're going to make one more daring run. Let's try to get 100% on this last... On this last level here. 73 days. Let's see if he can do it. Yeah, otherwise I would have been seen there had I not used my steam purge and it will regenerate but it regenerates very slowly unless of course you buy the upgrade for it which is a uh, questionable value uh, to a certain point um, maybe upgrade it once but I never I've never upgraded it all the way because it doesn't seem like the upgrade from the first step to the second step is that big but look at that. See, there's a bag of money in there. And so I'm going to plant a bomb right here. Ah, uh, fuck. God damn it. Sloppy. I had, the good, I had a good idea, but... Uh. Alright, this is going to for sure be it, because we are at 28 minutes, 28 seconds. And I wanted to keep this brief. For YouTube export reasons. And just because I think some videos are too long. I don't know if you've ever, you guys have ever heard of the 10 minute podcast, but same, same thing. Same, same, same focus. Things, too, things are too long. Things that are too long are too long, and don't do things that are too long. Keep things brief. Keep them tight. And we are ghost. And I think that is where we're going to leave off for today. So, um, I'll do this all, as often as I can. Uh, follow me here on Twitch. You'll know, you'll get notified, I'm sure, when I go live. You can follow me on Twitter as well. I am at Ozluop, which is Palzo backwards. And that is O-Z-L-U-A-P. Uh, generally, I will hit these on weekends, um, that sort of thing. Uh, so yeah, if you want to follow me on Twitter, you can do that. You can follow me here on Twitch, and uh, I'll be playing this. I'll be playing Metal Gear Solid Ground Zeroes. I'll be playing Metal Gear Solid The Phantom Pain uh, starting next week when it is out. And uh, if I can find a way to do it in the future, uh, you will be seeing some Super Mario Maker uh, levels go up on, uh, on YouTube as well. Um, haven't sorted all that out yet, but until next time, keep it classy.